Brexiteer John Redwood warns EU does not want fair trade deals so they can take our fish. Brexiteer John Redwood has accused the European Union of deliberately standing in the way of a fair Brexit trade deal and insisted it was now time for an independent UK. Talks on a post-Brexit trade deal are set to continue for the rest of the weekend with both sides still warning that the chances of agreement remain in the balance. Both Downing Street and the European Commission said the negotiations were still ongoing, but that significant differences remained over fisheries and the so-called level playing field rules. But Mr. Redwood said the EU was not interested in agreeing to a fair deal. The Tory former minister tweeted, the EU has made clear they do not want a fair free trade agreement. They want to control our laws, stop us backing our business, and take our fish. Time for an independent UK. The European Parliament has been pressing for an agreement by Sunday so it can ratify any deal before the current Brexit transition period ends on December 31. But it is thought EU leaders could provisionally sign off on a deal if the talks go on beyond that point, with formal ratification taking place in the new year. In the UK, MPs are on standby to return to Westminster from their Christmas break if an agreement can be struck in the final days of the year. Boris Johnson and the EU's chief negotiator Michel Barnier have played down the prospects of a breakthrough. The Prime Minister said the negotiations were proving difficult and called on the EU to see sense and to bring something new to the table. Earlier Mr Barnier told the European Parliament that the talks were approaching the moment of truth and that the path to an agreement was very narrow. If the there is no deal by the December 31st, the UK will leave the single market and customs union and begin trading with the EU on World Trade Organization terms, with the imposition of tariffs potentially leading to higher prices in the shops. Even with an agreement, there will be major changes at the border from January 1st with new customs checks, with fears of long delays if businesses are not properly prepared for the new rules. With less than two weeks to the changeover, the Commons Brexit Committee raised a series of concerns about the UK's overall state of readiness. In a report published today, they said decisions had been made too late, while communications with businesses had been patchy at best. Committee Chair Hilary Benn said the government still could not provide business, traders and citizens with certainty about what would happen.